What is going on you guys? This is Tech HD coming at you with a brand new how-to video. In this how-to video, what I'm going to be showing you guys is how to make your PC, your Windows PC, run a lot faster and a lot smoother. Now let's keep in mind though that this is not to make your internet speed run a lot faster. This is to make your computer run a lot faster, as in like opening applications or opening and boot time, stuff like that. So I'm gonna be showing you guys six easy steps on how to do this. So the first step that you're gonna to wanna to do is you wanna to go to start. Next, what you want to do is you want to go to run. You could type it, but I have it saved right here. And then you're going to want to put percent temp percent. Click OK. And then it will open up all of these unnecessary files that you honestly do not need. That's taking up so much space. So you want to hit Control A and it'll select everything and you just delete it. You right click and you delete it and it'll discover all these things. And you can see right here, it's so much things like 11 point something gigabits of speed I didn't have time to see it and don't worry if you are worried about deleting any personal things because that's what this is not what this is for this is basically to like delete all type of things that your computer does not need so you can see right here there are 46 uh, 467 items are, are too big to recycle do you want to permanently delete them yes so you can see right there so much things that are being deleted as of right now and it is ridiculous on how much things your computer saves for you so right here there you go see right there up oh, you see there you go do this for all current items skip that this one as well skip and you can see these things they your computer needs so right there like Nvidia this is for my GPU and my computer does need that so we are done with the first step now what we're going to do is we are going to go to start again you want to go to run once again and type in prefetch right here prefetch click OK same thing unnecessary files that your computer does not need so we're gonna hit control A once again and we are going to right click and delete see right there it deleted everything except one certain thing that I honestly do not know what it is but I'm not gonna mess around with that Next, what you're going to want to do is you want to uninstall, uninstall all type of programs that you have. So you want to click start. You're going to want to go to control panel, programs, uninstall a program. And these are all the programs that your computer has, all the applications. And there are certain type of applications that your computer does not need that is really for your internet browser. So like if you have a lot of ads opening up, you could go to here and you can see what it is and you can uninstall them. For me, I don't have anything that I really need to uninstall because I do this on like monthly which I do recommend that you do like you do this monthly to check it out check anything out anything that has been installed that you don't want in it so there you guys have it that is the third step now the fourth one is to go to task manager so you want to start you can always type this up and this works for Windows 7 8 10 which I'm using right now so you want to go to task manager and go to startup on the top and these are all the things that boot up once you turn on your computer. So basically, I have so many things and I have put them all into disable like Apple Push. I don't know what that is. Uh, Lexmark Device Monitor. That is for my printer. I have Wondershare Studio, which I have no idea what it is either. All type of unnecessary things. And if I do want things to start up, I put it into medium or low. So your computer doesn't have to worry that much about it all right so now the fifth step I believe we're on the fifth step yes the fifth step that we're gonna do is we're gonna disk clean up our drivers so basically you want to click start you want to go file explore this PC and basically the one that has the Windows the Windows boot you're gonna right click properties and you can see right here disk cleanup and it's gonna detect it's gonna system error it's basically gonna scan everything that your computer does not need so we're just gonna click everything we don't have to worry about it uninstalling any personal things and you can see right there 4.8 gigabits of, of unnecessary things so we're just gonna clean up system files and you can see right there it's just gonna be search uh, searching up anything else that's in your system files that your computer does not need once again and we're just gonna wait until it's done calculating and you can see right here I don't know why I went to the right side but over here again once again unnecessary things so we're just gonna click everything offline web pages system setup logs 
4.9 gigabits and then we're just want to we're just going to click ok delete files and it's just going to delete everything that's in your recycling bin things like that all right so as you can see it is now gone you are done with your drivers with this uh this cleanup so now what the final thing that we're going to do and this one is actually optional i don't I don't use it because it affects certain things of my computer that I want so it is to basically set your priority for your computer to best performance so you want to go to control panel then you're gonna to want to go to system and security system and then advanced system settings on the left and I have it on my other monitor right here and then you go to performance click settings and then you adjust for best performance and what it does is basically unchecks all these animations uh, type of things like transitions, thumbnails, smooth scroll, list box, all these types of things that really you don't need but it looks a lot better, it looks a lot more professional, it looks more modern so then you just want to click apply and ok and then it'll make your computer run a lot faster, a lot smoother and opening opening applications like file explorer you can see right there I'm just showing you guys quick examples control panel uh, let's see Firefox right there it opens up a lot faster so those are six easy steps on how to make your Windows PC run a lot faster and a lot smoother so I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comments down below if this actually helped you guys if you guys were having trouble with your computer being so slow because I've been doing this for a couple of years now and I've never made a video on how to make a computer run a lot faster and I've seen relatives friends that have computers that are extremely slow so I do it for them so there you guys have it hope you guys enjoyed the video please like comment subscribe follow me on Facebook Twitter YouTube Instagram and Twitch as always it's TechHD and I'll catch you guys in the next video peace